talk about the penis and nothing in this world can come in between us. For all of our fans from Mars to Venus. It's the Patrick and Scott Show. Welcome to the Patrick and Scott Show, starring Patrick and Scott. That's right. It's been, oh, a, it's been a week. Yeah. Hope you guys liked our new theme song. Yeah. We're going to be playing that with all episodes now, I believe. I believe so, unless unless I poop myself and it stops working. I don't know. Yeah. I hope you enjoy our new theme song. It's We enjoyed doing it. We enjoyed doing it. That was fun. <laughs> so... I am a genius, but I talk about penis. <laughs> yes, we do. <laughs> yes, we do. Both of us have genius IQs, and yes, we do. Always make, like, obscene jokes. That's about like, our penis. Yeah, yeah, about our penis. I am a genius, so I'll make racist comments. That doesn't rhyme, but it also happens. <laughs> yes, we also make... Everything is funny as long as your heart can handle it. Yes, we don't mean any of the things we say that are said in that kind of context. Yeah, it's humor. Unless it's about those damn Polacks. <laughs> uh, but okay. Take your pierogies elsewhere. In uh, recent news, uh, what is it? Uh, the primary. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that primary. Interesting. Yeah, yeah he won. <laughs> yeah. You all know who won. Yeah. So we South Carolina... Florida's coming up. Uh, we're, we're not even going to bother telling you who won because you know. You know. Yes, and let's not stress the fact that we're taping this. Uh, 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 okay, my point is <laughs> <laughs> we are doing this episode, which we call United SOPA Adversaries for Africa. USA yes. for Africa, like United Support of Artists for Africa, get it? It's like a sort of yeah. joke. We are the world, get it? Yeah. We and are the... We, uh, we are the children. We are the ones who make a better day. day. So let's stop giving. Here, can we gotta stop copyrighting infringement? So... They should make a law which allows copyright infringement rather than makes it harder. Yeah, fuck so. Sopa. That's what I said. <laughs> yeah, clearly, you see all these companies in Silicon Valley that create thousands and thousands of jobs opposing Sopa. Just stupid. And who supports it, you might ask? People who are in Hollywood, who haven't seemed to create any major jobs recently. Have you, have you heard about jobs in Hollywood, Scott, that are going... Not something? really, no. I haven't heard of... Uh, what's the term... Ain't heard jack shit. <laughs> Where's that copy in too? I don't know. Uh, I haven't heard Steve shit either. I'm playing a character named Steve in Almost Maine. You are. As well as a character named Pete and a character named Randy. Yes. Randy is going to have sex with my character. I, I, they're not going to portray that in the show, but it's implied heavily. It's implied very heavily. <laughs> That his penis goes into his poo-poo. Yeah. Randy and Chad. We're not really gay. I, I, I always say this. I'm not gay. I'm just a fetishist. I'm not gay. I just like raping children. I... He doesn't really. I mean. But I am really a fetishist. But... Yeah. <laughs> anyway. <sighs> Another news. Sopa! And how we must work to defeat it before it eats us all alive. With its evil rape tentacles. Something you know like it that. will! You bet it's not like it. Uh, Scott, please. Scott, come on, we're trying to do a show. I know, I'm just exposing my breasts for the internet. Nobody can see this, we're... Oh, well, they, if they're lucky, they will. 
Okay, well, uh, anyway. Sopa. Bad. Bad Sopa. Bad. Roll over! Don't make me rub your nose in it! <laughs> Bad Sopa! God damn it! Yeah, Sopa. Sopa's like that naughty dog that you just keep kind of smacking on And that nose. other bill, which is like P I P A. Peepa. Peepa, is that what it's called? I don't want to mispronounce it and sound like an idiot. Well, Piper, Peepa, one of those things. Peepa, Piper, they can go Peepa themselves because they can go fuck up themselves. Too. Those bills suck. Yeah, it's just a bill. It's only a bill, and I'll rape it on Capitol Hill. Okay. That's just me. But. <laughs> Anyway. Aren't you glad, Patrick, that I decide to remain in my regular American accent? Yes. When you don't, it makes me sad. And I have enough reasons to be sad, Scott. Don't we all, Herr Patrick? I guess my life is just so sad, right? Ah, uh, anyway. In a world where Bambi's mother gets shot. We should break into the song. Ah! <laughs> Dangerous. That's amazing. <laughs> Thank you. Just that's way. not what I meant. <laughs> and that's a different song by a different artist who lives in a different country. Oh, no, it's not. Yes, that's by Bruno Mars. Bruno Just Mars. the way you are. Dare. And God. he lives in America. No, he lives on Mars. He lives in Romania. No, he just... People think he's from Mars because he's so out of this is, world. Is he from Germany because his name is Bruno? He was born in Hawaii. He, uh, I know way more about music than anyone else on the face of the earth. Scott. That's not true. You don't know more than Jeebus. Well, he's not on Earth. He's in. How do you know? How do you know he's not chilling? Uh, yeah. He could be in the Bahamas right now. And honestly, who would blame him? It's really nice there. But they don't have any taxes, which is sweet. He could be in Florida healing the old people. Or Qatar. They don't have any taxes either. I, I don't like playing guitar anymore. No, Qatar, the country, not guitar. Qatar is the country, and it's near Saudi Arabia. It's like a little peninsula, and they it has a very small population. But they know, have, it's in between Saudi Arabia and Durka Durkistan. They have no taxes. They have free health care, free electricity, free uh, college education. Like everything's free there. It's like a. Can like I move there? I suppose you could. Would they accept me? And they're the only Arab country, I believe, that has free media. They are, I believe, actually. So we can move there to escape Sopa. <laughs> Fuck you, Soap. Now America will be like the other Arab countries. We'll need to have the American Spring, eh? <laughs> During spring break, you can go down to their wonderful Seriously, beaches and that's... see these hot women wrapped in their towels. Hot <laughs> women? Yes. Dangerous That's amazing, Scott. Yeah. You know what else is amazing? I got a haircut for the first time in, like, months. Really? Yeah. Did your hair grow really slow or something? No, my hair was, like, out to here before. I just didn't... Yeah. I never, like... If I combed it up... Because it, it just... Yeah, but, like, if I, I hadn't got a haircut in months, mine would be, like... Mine just gets really curly and it grows, like, in upon itself. You know what I mean? It just it just stays and it's annoying. So I'm like, I'm getting a haircut, and now it's it's nice and short. You want me to feel it or feel it, feel it for the microphone. Can you hear that, audience? <laughs> okay, I <laughs> felt Scott's hair. I like it short. My girlfriend doesn't. You. You may have irreconcilable differences, Scott. No, it's actually pretty good. Like this one time. <laughs> wait, there's all these... Wait, this one time this girl wanted me, but I she, I played her this song by Red Userbu, and she didn't like it, so I was like, see, oh, things already. will never work out with us. And then there was this other time, there was this girl who had the audacity to claim that she thought the Beatles were better than Ozen. Well... I mean, can if you by, believe that? If by better you mean they put out more stuff so far, then, then yes. No, I mean, she actually liked their songs better. Uh, uh, and that's just sick. But <laughs> that is, I, I kind of want to throw up a little bit in my mouth. Because of this trash she's spewing. I know. 
So few girls get me, Scott. It's just... Why? One day they'll How? get you, and you'll get them all. That's a clever pun, but... It is quite punny. <sighs> oh, my nipples have been so sore! Sore? Yeah, I think I'm pregnant. Special orphan running exercises? Yes, they have been doing special orphan running exercises. It's, it's terrible. They keep telling them to stop. We both know. read all those books, so if you have a question related to those books... It'll be unfortunate. <laughs> yes, it, it will be unfortunate. But we'll answer it, right, Scott? Because we, we know. It. Because we love you. Unlike your parents, we love you. <laughs> People's parents never love them, but they always say they do. I love you, son. No, you can't go outside past midnight. Fuck you, Dad. Fuck you very, very much. I say that every time you do that. Aww, that's so cute! Why must I always be that? Yeah, you! God, this is supposed to be humor, not just totally goofy, whatever the fuck. Let's do, uh... What are those freaking cops we want to freaking do? I think it was Mac and Bacardi! Mac and Bacardi! This is a new skit we're doing to oppose Sopa. So, basically... Fuck it's so. Help! Help! Mac! Bacardi! I'm on private jet! It runs low on fuel! You don't but say! But there's these people! These people are listening to my music! They love my material! But they couldn't buy it and still feed their kids! They're one of the families! I mean, one in eight families we have kids that go to bed hungry in this country! But instead, they... Of feeding their kids! I mean, they should still be thinking about this singer they love so much, you know what I mean? They're sick! I, mean, I, I earned that money by, uh, wait, I, I, I sing, I, I mean, well, I don't really sing, it's, it's more an auto-tuner singing, but, uh, I mean, they don't, I don't, uh, I, uh, write music, well, actually, other people write it, but, well, uh, I, I suck up to the liberal media most, and I deserve a reward! It's okay, T-Pain, we'll help you. T-Pain? Yes. I'll, I'll tell you. These people are. Anyway, we gotta find this perpetrator. Yes, we do. Come on, Put the Mac. smack down on him. Let's get him, Mac. Yeah! McCarty! Hey! Let's go! Hey, up! There he is. There's a poor person listening to music. Let's get him! You son of a bitch! Ah, uh, come on, dude. What are you doing? You don't have money. Therefore, you don't deserve to enjoy music. You don't deserve to live, buddy. Oh, come on, man. What's your problem, dude? What? What, what, are, what are these guys doing, man? We're here to teach you a lesson, bub. But, no. We're, we're not... We're just two guys who, who don't have... Two guys who money. are communists. Get the fuck Not out of my America! Kindness, man, we just we just want to listen to some music. And... Yeah, yeah, just want to listen and not pay for it like a commie. We, we... You get over here. You have much explaining to do, young man. And you too, slightly younger man, smoking the doobie. Yeah, we'll teach you to have things that don't belong to you. You son of a bitch! God, yeah. oh, dude, why'd you hit me? You know, you're taking a job from people in Alex. But dude, how Hollywood never creates jobs. Like, the, the, you're, you're thinking of Silicon Valley. Just because Silicon Valley who creates jobs is against it, and Hollywood who doesn't is for it, then that doesn't mean... Wait, what? You know we, what? We risk our lives to protect the interests of those who have more than us because they don't risk their lives. That's right, Bob. And if you don't start learning that fast, you're gonna find my fist halfway up your ass. Dude, that rhyme, I like it. You should make that a song. So you can steal it, you son of a bitch. <laughs> oh, man, that hurt. It better hurt. It won't hurt as much as you're raping our economy. Wow, man, that's deep. Not as deep as you're raping our economy. 
Okay, that was our skit about Mac and Bacardi. Cops enforcing soap. That's right. <laughs> Cops enforcing soap. Those hippies don't want to be clean. Oh, that made me feel pretty good. Didn't it? <laughs> don't you feel pretty good right now? <laughs> I feel yeah. pretty good. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh. I need a nap now. That was... That wore down on me. We should, we could play Don't Download This Song to enforce that, but we don't do that anymore because of copyright infringement. I think that's a song he doesn't care if you download. <laughs> Honestly, I, th I think that was the whole idea of that. Well, that's just me. Well, yeah, we're avoiding, uh... The video's free on his YouTube. Yeah, it is. So... Watch it all you want, motherfucker. Yeah, watch it because we can't play it because of... Rapists just like me. Scott, you're ruining everything. I don't ruin everything. I just ruin most things. Give me a hug. Here's a hug, Patrick. Can you hear our hug? It's International Hug Day. It is International Everybody Hug Day. Everybody has to hug me. If you're listening to this... Hug me. But, okay, now we've sort of revealed that we did this a week in advance if they know what International Hug Day is. That's right. Okay, we're, we're sorry for trying to get around to things in the news segment, but we're, we're trying our best, so please. We're trying so hard, and we just want you to love us. That's all we want. Love me, love me, love me, la 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 la. Love okay, me, copyright. love me, love me, wah 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 wah. Copyright, Scott. Copyright infudgment. Uh, anyway, so uh, does Romanian copyright apply here? I think it might, actually, yes. <laughs> Damn okay. it. But whatever. Um, we are not that funny. I am fucking sorry. I. We're more than that funny. We are. We're amazing. Dangerous feelings break out my soul. It's just the this the chat. We can't do this in every freaking episode. No, we can't. But I'm gonna cling to it as long as I can because oh, it makes me feel so good. Yeah, we 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 need to think of another artist to like do. We should do like a different artist where we break into their songs randomly throughout the episode. There's not, not a thing, thing that I would change Of your amazing Just, just the way you are You're so off tune that I can't even bother with it That's because I'm And when I'm you smile The whole world stops and stares for a while It's good you amazing Just the way you are Okay, this is our Bruno Mars episode. This is our Bruno Mars episode. Yes, it is. What you don't understand is I catch a grenade for you. Good. Good. <laughs> die. Tommy. Tommy, die. What is this? What are we doing, Scott? Help! 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 I can't help, I'm touching myself. Hey, uh, what is wrong with you? What the fuck are you talking about? Oh, no, no, not these guys again. <laughs> hey, I am back to do your show. What am I talking about? I'm back, I shouldn't be back. I died, technically. I'm I thought person. you were just taking a bath in tomato juice. The way Very you wise, stateless. You see, he stabbed me, but he only stabbed me in my foot and... Good thing you got, like, nothing important. Kinda hurts, but I live. I live! Ha <laughs> ha! That's right, I live! Do you like olive on your salad? Uh, they have olive in Greece. I do not like Greece. They are deceptive. Not just that, they're quite greasy. Yes! I don't like hair, either. Greece or hair? Uh, do you think it's fun? Yes, it no, is. No, I don't have problem with either musical. No, it's very nice. But the point is that Greece is so deceptive because they be in Eastern Europe, but they not act like Eastern Europe. They're, they're so Western. 
Mm-hmm. They're very much Western, but not just Western, just God forsaken Americans. Do you, this is sad. Do you see Greece? So Western! In, in, in Eastern Europe, it makes me want to cry. I bet she even supports Sopa. I know it! I know they support Sopa. Fuck Sopa. Fuck it. Fuck it hard. Why would you even bend over for Sopa? Don't you know the Sopa! They say they want combat pilot. <laughs> you know what I would do if I American? What would you do? I go, I go to Drobeard, put on hat, get parried, go to their house, and shoot them with cannon. <laughs> I'd go up there and be like, I would be like, Arr! Why do people want me to take away my place. internet piracy? I want to go to people and just say, Arr! And take their money. What's wrong with that? <laughs> That's what I do personally. That is that is hilarious. But people should do that. Go to their house, dress as pirates, get cannon, tell them what to blank. Yes, and I would have a parrot that I'd teach to say, Frog Shopa! Frog Shopa! <laughs> Why are you guys here? I thought we were clear that we didn't want you here. Well, you see, we don't give a shit, so... Why you not want me? I don't give a fuck if they want me or not. I'm coming in the studio and I'll take a big dump all over your computer set. You will not take a dump on my computer set, you dirty ginger or ex-ginger or How whatever you dare are. you! You are not... What is wrong with you? This is... This is madness. This is insane. Let's leave, Seamus. These people offend me. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Goodbye and good riddance for fucking on so much of <laughs> Well, uh, reverse psychology is a wonderful thing. It's a good thing I got a D in it. Reverse psychology? No, just psychology in general. Oh. Well, that, the reverse Which is the reverse of, of what I wanted to get. Yeah, no, the, you're, you got an A in reverse psychology because you got a D in psychology, which would be the opposite. I'd get a B, wouldn't I? Well, yeah, I guess F, but... Well, I guess it's the opposite end of the passing grade spectrum. I mean, I'd, I'd be happy. You could have got extra credit. F would be like if you got extra credit. Oh. But, 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 but you got an A without extra credit. That would be the opposite of a B. Fuck yeah! <laughs> Fuck super yeah! Oh. We should all be doing something else. Yes, we should be. I should be touching myself and screaming. Okay. We're fucked up beyond all repair. So... Let's take a break. Yeah, we're going to play... I think you've heard of these guys. at Cholera. Cholera. We're going to be playing a song from their uh, EP. It's a very famous local band. If you live in Cleveland, you've heard of them. They've they've definitely been around. I I know most of the people in the band. The last guys, Tim and Tom Bath. Uh, We will... Be playing their song, The Answer to Infection, from their EP, The Answer to Infection. It's a very great CD. You can get it on iTunes. You can get it in physical copy if you live in the area. Or if you email them or something, I'm sure they'll be very glad to help you out. So, uh, enjoy The Answer to Infection by Cholera. Fuck Sopa. Fuck Sopa.
Welcome back to the Patrick and Scott Show. Starring Patrick. And Scott. We're going to have a nice little news segment coming up with our favorite two co-anchors, Bill Cosby and Hans, Hans Brinker. Brinker. That's right. We're going to start off with Hans with the weather. Yeah, yeah, we're going to do some weather up in here. It's going to be really nice. And uh, we're going to figure out just how horrible it is today. How does that sound? Well, it sounds pretty good, Hans. Uh, is it really hot or really cold? Uh, well, you see, in uh, Middleburg Heights, where we are right now, it's 27 degrees Fahrenheit, but not Celsius because you people don't use that because you're insane. Um, it's going to be shitty pretty much the rest of your lives here. Um, if Cleveland's... 27 degrees Celsius, wouldn't that be really hot? Oh, yeah, it would burn your skin right off your body. And then, uh... Not that bad. Oh, trust me, it's that hot, baby. like 80-something, right? No, no, don't lie to me. So, Cleveland's 28 degrees, New York's 27 degrees, and Florida is a wonderful 75. And Bucharest is 33. That's right, Bucharest is 33! Uh, Cape Town, South Africa was in the, I believe, middle 70s. But, uh, yeah, that's the weather for today! I hope you all enjoyed yourself. I'm going to, uh... I'm gonna go back. It was uh, before you guys called me. I was masturbating, and uh, I didn't appreciate being interrupted. But uh, of course, I have a job to do, other than the other job I was doing from my penis. So I'm going to get back to my penis job, and now you can get back to to talking into the microphone thingy job. And then after that, I'll go back to subjugating the world's Jews. I mean. Preserving 1941 Germany. Okay, uh, oh, goodbye, uh, Hans. Well, goodbye. It's nice to see you all. Nice to see you doing. Well, that was enlightening yet again. Is the sports report coming on? Oh, yeah, sports report's coming on. You know, everyone really loves our sports guy. I mean, who can really blame him? I mean... He was one of TV's most famous personalities for the longest time. He's kind of a psychopath. He's, he's one not of my a psychopath. He's just a psycho. How can people not know the difference? Because he went on a killing rampage too. I didn't know that. No one did. You know why? Because he was good at covering it up. You know what's really fun? When Bill Cosby has a chocolate cake or pudding or jello, and all he does that episode is talk about chocolate cake or pudding or jello. Because he gets so excited about it. You can feel just like like the unrelenting joy at that at that treat. You know what I mean? The sports report is loading a little slow, so I'm gonna have Bill Cosby read something else for you guys. Because this is something just as important. And why is it just as important? Because it's about the Amish, which is clearly something that is very pertinent to this day and age. Okay. Hello, everybody! Bill Cosby! It's good to be back in the place and the pudding is everywhere and all that shit on the walls. So... Happy International Hug Day! Give me a hug, you son of a bitch! Oh, look at him. He's not black, so he doesn't look at the chocolate cake. So anyways... I look like white chocolate cake. No, no, it doesn't count. Go back to the Whatcracker house. So anyway... In Amish land, which is in Ohio, because the rest of them killed themselves because there's no electricity, there's a dude named Samuel Mullet Sr. Now you know there's a problem when he's not a redneck, but his name is Mullet. There's nothing good gonna happen there. Especially since he's white. So it turns out he saved a couple other Amish beards, and they don't do that because then the devil will rape them down the throat by taking pictures of them, and then the pudding will fly down their throat as he takes a shit. So as he was under dress, now he's got surveillance equipment in his house, which is electricity to the call, and so now he's a danger to his community because he's got electronics in his house. That kind of sucks now, doesn't it? You get kicked out of your house because you got shit in your house. Mm. That 
would suck. They would suck harder than Theo on his friend a cockroach, because he's got cockroach in his name. <laughs> Isn't that great? So anyway, today the Cleveland Cavaliers are going to face the Atlanta Hogs, and they're going to play a game, and it's going to be good. The I Cavs are 6-8, and eight and the Hawks are 11-5, and five and we don't have LeBron, so we're going to lose. <laughs> it's okay, because Jesus loves us, everyone! Okay. Oh. Well, I can tell you how to remind me of the time that I had some pudding and it went down my mouth hole and then I had too much and I choked on it and I died and I went to hell and he didn't like me so he sent me back. Interesting. Yeah, they don't put black people in hell. We go to purgatory. I'm not going to... That was Bill Cosby with the sports report. Remember, if you're ever feeling sad, kill yourself. Have a great day. Should I kill myself, Scott? I don't think Bill Cosby is the best person to listen to when it comes to advice. But I, I get sad. I'm sad a lot. Patrick. Should I kill myself, Scott? No, Patrick, or should you shouldn't I kill yourself. You should keep on carrying on. For the sake of this great nation, you must keep on keeping on. In the name of our dear John F. Kennedy, which is me. What the fuck am I doing here? Speaking of uh, politics, uh, South Carolina primary. Here's what a debate might have been like if all the candidates who dropped out were there instead of the ones that didn't drop out. Okay, candidates, you have a minute to answer this. How do you think America should deal with illegal immigration? Well, you see, the problem is Obama. He's putting his big black dick in all of this administration and it is just ruining our America. Okay. I cede the rest of my time to my opponents. Thank, thank you, Mrs. Bachman. Yes, Mr. Right. Mr. Kane, uh, what, what we need is a bold plan. 9% individual income tax, 9% corporate tax, 9% national sales tax. That will solve all the problems, including this problem with gays in the military. But, but, but Mr. Uh, Kane, we were talking about, no, no, 9% individual income tax, 9% corporate tax, 9% national sales tax. Uh, okay, uh, Mr. Perry. Well, you see, the problem is the homosexuals. They're taking over everything, and they're putting their dongs of evil into our economy. And we cannot stand for this. If we eliminate all the homosexuals, then we will have a freer America. And that's what we all want, isn't it? I suppose. Uh, you don't want everyone to lose the game, do you? I lost the game. I'm calling this debate off. That's the end. Well, that's good. Those damn homosexuals. Oh. We are so fucked. Please listen to next week's show. I promise it'll be better. Well, this week isn't bad. We even had a new theme song. Okay. I mean, this week, I think we're just kind of tired. We should like, I was working out till 1 o'clock in the morning, like a little bit past that. We shouldn't be so tired. We shouldn't be, like, the funniest guys in America. That's I who... know why I'm so tired. It wasn't because I worked out. It's because I didn't masturbate last night. Scott, masturbate when you're doing this show. You, you could, if you're going to do the show, you need to masturbate for... You bet your left teddy I'm serious. Scott, I'm male. I am the post service. Where the uh, where the elves got jobs in Weird Al's song, The Night Santa Went Crazy. Exactly. I'm peeling an orange.
If I were an orange, so would you. Because nothing rhymes with it, except more orange. Door hinge rhymes with it. Yeah, but that's two words. Oi vey. Have you ever been so A pirate tired? doesn't say oi vey. A pirate says arg. Arg vey. <laughs> Somehow that sounds worse. I'm a Jewish pirate, arg vey. <laughs> Who's your good girl? Who's your good girl? Little Edward's eating my neck and cheese. <laughs> yes, she is. She's going to eat it all and then she's going to be morbidly obese. You probably heard Bridget upstairs. She's busy being a uh, stupid head. She gives me horrible gas. And so I expel it on her face area. <sighs> Have you ever been so tired that you couldn't even masturbate during the night, Patrick? I hear my phone. You hear yourself eating? No. The audience love that. Do they? Please leave a comment. Leave something. We're so pathetic. We're sorry. Say why you love us. Tell me all the reasons. I want to be able to sleep happily tonight. If we're such attention whores, we need your attention or we'll kill ourselves. We... I'm just a regular whore. I don't know what's going on. Scott? Yes? You are an attention whore. At least both. I'm more of a whore whore, though. I like the sex. It's nice. Sex is dangerous, Scott. Not if you were a condom. They say it's safe sex. I've never had sex with a safe. So, yeah, have you ever had sex with a sofa? No, but I have had it with sofa. I mean, so. Scott! I'm sorry, it... Sleeping with the enemy? It was ready and willing and free. Unlike everything... We won't be with. free if we... Uh... <laughs> we won't be free under SOPA. Yes, so fuck SOPA. And yet you want to be under SOPA. Huh? No, actually, under... I was on top. Ooh, clever. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> It'll sever your testicles and no, shove them it, down it, your throat well, and make you... It didn't do that exactly, no, but... And make you into its little goat. I don't want to be a goat. I don't want to be a goat at all. Wait, wait what were those those girls? The what you call them? From the, the comedy? Which one? Garfunkel and Oates. Garfunkel and Oates. Oh, those girls, those girls. We... we they make my winky happy. Does anything not make your winky happy, Scott? Communism. Valid. Very valid. It makes my winky limpy. But... Well, you've got to admit, it would be kind of sexy to be tortured by one of those hot KGB agents with their... You know how they torture those American guys. They twist your nipples until you beg for more. Oh. I'm, I'm No, wait, that was just my dream last night. What? I had a hot KGB agent. She's like, if you don't tell me what you'll know, American, I will twist your nipples and tell you cry. I'm like, okay. She's like, I, I do not understand. I'm like, you don't have to, just do it. <laughs> She's like, fine. And she twisted it. I'm like, yes. Oh, yes, yes. And she's like, this is not working. I'm like, you should have sex with me now. She's like, this is not torture. I'm like, you don't know that. <laughs> I'm like, you thought this would be torture, so how about you try that? Maybe that's torture. She's like, okay. So we had hot, sloppy sex. And uh, she's like, you know what? I'm defecting. Let's go to America. I'm like, that's fine by me. I mean, but we have we have sofa. She's like, oh, no, I'm not going. It's, it's more oppressive than... <laughs> It is more oppressive to have people force their soap. <laughs> we're, 
Please, no, 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 no. Yeah. You got a Ford, Scott? What? You got a Ford. A Ford? Ford Middle School? Yeah, I got a Ford. I get sweat. No, I mean, like, in, in sixth grade choir, me and Racco had, used to make these, like, joke songs. I was not in sixth grade choir. Uh, I was but, in sixth grade band. But then I realized the error of my ways, and I went to choir. Oh. Well, anyway, uh, I used to be in a uh, band, I think, in fifth grade. I played, the, I played the clarinet. That's always fun. I captured a puppy. She's no, but in sixth grade, there was this one song that was like, Picture a playground filled with the happy sound of children who dream and explore with no thought of war. So, you know that song? Yeah. It's been a while, but I remember it. Yeah, okay, but so, I thought it was sixth grade, Claire. But me and Rocco made our own version that was like, Picture a playground. Filled with the happy sound of children who dream and explore. <laughs> bam, bam! Not <laughs> anymore. <laughs> and then they were dead. And you never hear what all the kids were dead. They got shot at by Tupac. Tupac? Yes. He Tupac. wasn't the one doing the shooting. He was the one being shot by Biggie Smalls. That's what they wanted you to think. Biggie Smalls is the bad guy here. We all know it. But you know why they called him Biggie Smalls? He was a big guy, but he had a small ego. And penis. Okay. Biggie Small. You heard it right here. Big guy, small penis. And he killed Tupac. Damn it. Oh, anyway. Oh, the sound of sweet, sweet burritos. The sound of love. When human nature feels the sound, we tear it down and justify. We need a girl to be like, sex. S sex? Okay, well, this, this, is, chip. this is too creepy if we do it ourselves. Yeah! <laughs> I don't think she likes those kind of Doritos. Oh, yeah, she does. See, there she goes. Come on! Go get it. Move, you little bitch. It's funny because she's a female dog. <laughs> Go get it. Go get Chip. Go get Chip. Dumbass. I love it. I wish I had a donkey who was not very intelligent. Then I could be like, dumbass. Dumbass. <laughs> you dumbass. <laughs> It's funny because he's a donkey and a donkey is an ass. Well, my, you might not, not want to say that once you get to know him, Scott. I mean, you dumb but still a very nice ass. Okay, then. Where do you think we should go from here? Well, where do we go from here? Where do we go from here? Scott, what did we promise our viewers in last week's show? What did we promise them? What did we promise them? We said we are going to perform a song from Leonardo. Yes, we did. So now that's what we're going to do next. Let us perform a song from Leonardo. I gave her all the love in my heart Looking back, I can't imagine why She took my arm, she tore it apart And she left me there to die I knew I couldn't have given her more I had nothing left to give 
Okay, hey, that yeah. was yeah, that was our um, Leonardo. That's from from Leonardo for on our for show that we're working on right now. Did you hear Edward Warren to sing along? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, yeah, it was about um, uh, you know Rose from Titanic. He's but thinks she's so upset that he she leaves, and then he meets uh, Amaranth, which is. Which is a deeper thing. It's like a deeper true love kind of thing. The what I was going for there was like rose amaranth. If you can get the most people won't get it, but like an amaranth is uh, it's another type it's, of flower. Yeah, it's another type of flower. It 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 doesn't fade the way a rose does, eh? which is what I was going for with the the name. <laughs> It's really nice. It's a very beautiful name. It's a very beautiful thing to do. It's yeah. If if you don't get the joke for, uh, well, it, what happens is we're doing a musical, Leonardo and Tip and Taro. It's about Leonardo DiCaprio. Like what happens to him between Titanic and Inception? Because if you haven't noticed, he uh, falls into the ocean and he wakes up on a beach. Yeah. So it's like, anyway, her father doesn't want them together. He gets Dr. Clank to uh, hypnotize him to think he's... Uh, Don't ruin the ending. Oh, oh, okay, I'm sorry, but... Snape killed Dumbledore. Snape. What was the thing we were doing with Snape? My name... My name is Snape, and I like to eat grapes. I'm in jail for rape, and I just clean the drapes, nigga. What is, no, 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 no. I'm Michael Jackson, man. I what is it? And I rape little kids. Rape little kids. I no, no. I rape little boys. Rape little boys. I'm Michael Jackson, man. I rape little boys. I give them some wine and I show them my toys. My penis. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and the snake one was like genius, and it was supposed to go to. This, this is rhymes with penis. Just, just like in our intro. We, yeah, just there's so much penis. So much genius. So much penis. And nothing can come in between us for our fans from Mars to Venus. Yeah. And then more about my penis. And now we have a dog scratching herself in the studio. It's okay, because she's fuzzy and lovable, and she keeps trying to escape, but we won't let her. Because this is her prison. Prison. And she still looks happily upward. Don't you understand what prison is? You're going to get raped. That's disturbing, Scott. We don't want to talk about that. Scrub, scrub here, scrub, scrub there. When well, you <laughs> have some nuts. Butts. Nothing rhymes with nuts, Scott. Butts. Butts. Yeah, but it's very low. It's not like Scott, where like everything rhymes with it. It's more like Patrick. You could be like, show us your mat, or, or show us your hat trick. Hat trick. That rhymes. Hat trick. It's two words, though. Exactly, but it's it's so hard to rhyme with Patrick Scott. This is a so really hard. hard game. I lost the game. Why do you do this to me, Scott? I, I didn't mean to. It just it was just the what words I thought would be best. Uh, now I'm gonna have that song stuck in my head. Speaking of songs, uh, I think it's time for uh, your next know, song. Uh, okay, let's do it. We're gonna go to our next song. This is uh, what song are we playing next, Patrick? We are playing... It's off the compilation again. Compilation of what, Scott? Is... Oh, I think I know what you're saying. You're saying we are playing Our Addiction by Jackie? I believe we're playing Our Addiction by Jackie. Another local band. Very great. I think you really enjoy this song. So please enjoy Our Addiction it's by Jackie. It's a hardcore, Jack. like, song. Like, we're doing this... You can feel it. It's heavy because... This is the heavy week because we're being heavy on Sopa being a dildo. Yeah. This, again, is our episode, which is called United Sopa Adversaries for Africa. Because when you defeat Sopa, a kid in Africa is fed. You may not have heard that. You but may not have true. heard that because it isn't true. But it's true. No, it really isn't. I mean... It isn't, but it is. Please don't confuse people. I, I don't want to go to hell for saying I'll help kids okay. in Africa when so we're not doing So please enjoy it. this song, and don't lose the game. Fuck Sober. 
Fuck Sopa. And Soap. Sopa. Addiction, right? It's it, certain, well. My addiction is alcohol. No, I don't mean it's our. I mean the song is our addiction. Oh, oh, well, I agree. It's a very good song. No, I mean the song is called our addiction. Oh, no, if you say just because she says that a million times doesn't mean it is. Scott, the song's called our addiction. Anyway. Anyway. God damn it, Edward. Edward is sabotaging all of our efforts. She's gonna support Sopa. No! No! Not my puppy! She couldn't support Sopa. She's a good girl. She doesn't know any better. She she thinks that the the rights of artists go above everyone else. It's so wrong. <laughs> okay, well this has been. United Sopa Adversaries for Africa, and we hope you like our penises. I mean, our genius. Uh, I, we hope you like both of them, to be honest. We, I mean, we hope you're not... I hope if you're on Mars or Venus and you're like some kind of astronaut or something, you can still hear our show, because we love astronauts. And I like... Ass. Is... And they like my trone nuts. Wait, are you saying you like... Big butts and I cannot lie.
You other brothers can't deny. Nah. When a girl walked in, it'd be the waist and a cup of coffee right in front of the where sprung. Oh, it's all wrong, Scott. I can't help it. Don't, do you want to get sued? Do you want to get sued? So it makes you like, can't have any money anymore. I, I, yeah, I, 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 I generally doubt that he has any. <coughs> I'm eating Doritos. That's incredibly irresponsible, but we're... But it's okay. It's okay, because he's... It's the best show ever! It's the best show ever! I know, copyright infringement. Who's president of China? I, I prefer the. What do you mean? The who. But who's president of China? I know, I'm talking about the who. Don't you know who the no, who is? No, but you can, you can I know who the who is. They're a band. But what I mean is who's president of China? It's funny because like people think it's a question, but it's really a statement. H.U. is president of China. But people don't understand that because people are stupid. Scott, I'm... I hate that everyone's so stupid. Right? But then I move back to my home planet and everyone makes fun of me for being so stupid because there I'm stupid because everyone like has like a super ultra mega IQ. Patrick, it's, it's, it's not your fault that you were born on Planet Da Vinci. It's, it's, it's not. <laughs> One day we will be better. And then we will kill everyone who opposed us. But until that day, unless Bill Cosby's doing it. Right. Bill Cosby doesn't do the weather, does he? No, Hans does it. That's why yeah. I said it's done unless Bill Cosby does it. Aww, I'm trying to make fun Hans. of Hans because... Uh, Hans might hear this and think we're Jewish. <sighs> You know how he is about those people. Yes, because that's the whole joke of Hans, is that he's an ex-Nazi who doesn't want anyone to know he's a Nazi. But... Shh, 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 shh. He'll find us. He'll find a way to rape me. So, um, it's been a pretty good show, actually. I'm kind of... I'm pretty happy about it. How about you, Pat? You happy about it? We said what we could to oppose Sopa. I tried to fuck some soap. And these side rap. Oh. We're not even that big fans of rap, and we're not even... And that whole thing's hey, over. Hey, for shizzle, Patrick! And then that, that whole thing's over, and all of those things are... But nevertheless, we think we'll just take a position on something. Even though we have no basics, in fact, for anything to do with it. <laughs> You know, I hear that Hitler guy was a nice guy. <laughs> Whatever! Edward, where'd you go? Oh, no. My dog wants to die in a fiery inferno. That's why she's going near our furnace. <laughs> That's right. Do you want to burn in hell, Edward? Do you want Just to like burn the kids hell? who want to get the nuts and Willy Wonka. Or um, the uh, eggs, depending on... It depends on what version of the movie. I actually, I mean. Is Timmy stuck in the well? I don't know why they changed that scene in the first movie, but. And other than that, I generally prefer the first movie because it's like. Uh, it's got all those songs, you know? Yeah. The Candyman can. The Candyman can. When he copyrighted. Ah, oh, stop it! <laughs> I hate you so much. That's not a nice thing to say at all, Patrick. <laughs> you know you don't hate me. You hate copyrights. Which you should. You should hate copyrights. God, he mixes it with love and Mix the birds burn in hell. Blood. And copyright sucks because we really want to think it should. <laughs> oh, that is wonderful. Hunts. What are you doing here? Your segment's over. No, it's not! I haven't told you about the best part! Edward, what are you doing? 
You're not even touching me inappropriately. Give me a kiss. I mean, we are just fucking crazy. Nazis, West Side, Willy Wonka. It, uh, like, it doesn't Nazis, matter. West Side, Willy Wonka, Bill Cosby. I know. It's just like follows a tangent. There's like no rhyme or reason. There's no rhyming reason unless it goes with the season and the made one because Rudy's dumbass. Okay. That was great! Oh. Tell to do! What? Copyright? No. Okay! That was the freaking Patrick and Scott show and. Starring, starring freaking Patrick and Scott! Okay, the sh the, okay but seriously, we got we gotta go, guys. It's. I gotta go masturbate and then t be a lifeguard, which uh, are two non-mutually exclusive things, actually. Okay, let, let's talk about that. But anyway, fuck Sopa. Fuck Sopa. And, uh, yeah. Two okay. Jews walk into a bar, and they say, fuck Sopa. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if you're a Jew against Sopa, comment. Yes, and if you're, and if you're uh, someone who's not Jewish who's against SOPA, comment. And if you're a Jew against SOAP, comment and then clean up. That would actually be very interesting, but anyway, whatever. Fuck SOPA. Fuck SOPA. <laughs>